Hello, I'm Chris Clark, Iowa State University Extension Beef Specialist, with this week's Cow Tip Tuesday. Today I would like to offer a few suggestions to improve the biosecurity of your cow-calf operation. The term biosecurity simply means management practices designed to prevent the introduction and spread of disease. I like to say that biosecurity is all about awareness, cleanliness, and separation. So what are some practical things that you can do to improve biosecurity and protect your herd? Number one, manage visitors. Post a sign indicating that your farm practices biosecurity measures and that all visitors must check in. Use designated parking areas, require clean boots, and keep visitor logs in case there is ever a need for contact tracing. Establish lines of separation and approved traffic patterns for custom haulers, rendering trucks, feed delivery trucks, and other necessary visitors. Number two, maintain fences. Without good fences, your biosecurity program is only as good as that of your neighbors. Number three, quarantine new animals. Newly acquired animals should be quarantined for 30 days before introduction into the existing herd. Think also about animals that leave the farm for exhibition, move between farm sites, and even those that are hauled to clinics for veterinary care. It may be wise to quarantine after such events before reintroduction into the herd. Number four, buy from reputable sources with good health records. Buy virgin bulls or bulls that have been tested negative for Tritrichomonas fetus and consider testing new animals for BVD PI status. Communicate with breeders about status for diseases like Yoni's disease and bovine leukosis. Number five, control insects, rodents, and other potential vectors. And number six, improve cleanliness and disinfection protocols to reduce transmission through contaminated boots, clothing, tires, and other equipment. Consider separate equipment for different situations or locations. For example, consider simply having a couple different pairs of boots, one to be used strictly on farm, and another for trips to the gas station, co-op, sale barn, and other public spaces. For more information about biosecurity, please check out the new daily biosecurity plan for disease prevention at bqa.org.